What is up, Indies and fans? Today, we are taking a look at the demo for Escape from Ever After, and they even titled the demo. It's Onboarding. This is the prequel to the upcoming game uh, for Flint Buckler, the fictional character who we are seeing the story of, and an evil corporation has invaded his story. So we're going in to save the day. This has a Paper Mario type style, especially in the aesthetic, and I love it from what I've seen so far. So I'm excited. Let's jump in. Let's see how the demo goes. All right, so we'll start a new game. Welcome to Escape from Ever After Onboarding. This prologue version of the full game includes the introduction up to the end of an edited chapter one. Important details there. If you enjoy your time playing our game, we'd appreciate it if you leave a review on Steam. You got it. Every single review helps more than you know. No, it really does. Like, we all read them. We all check them. It's, it's a big purchase, time commitment, so on and so forth. All right, think We hope you enjoy. I do. I, me too. This looks up my alley. All right, today I'm going to read you one of my favorite stories. <clears throat> Once upon a time, in a realm of lush forests and shimmering rivers, there lived a hero named Flint Buckler. For ages, Flint had valiantly pursued his quest to vanquish Tender the Dragon, a fearsome creature hidden away in her sprawling castle, guarding untold riches and treasures. Flint's battles with Tender were fierce and brutal, but alas, he never succeeded. Man, look at that art. Trying time and time again, Flint sought to bring an end to Tender's reign of terror. Their rivalry had become the stuff of legends, whispered among villagers as a tale of unyielding resolve. Once again, Flint found himself standing before the towering entrance of Tender's castle, bracing himself for one final confrontation. The familiar fortress looming above Flint's heart fluttered with anticipation, knowing that winning this final battle with Tinder would settle their ages old feud and determine his legacy as a hero. Oh, it's time. Look at my boy, ready to take on the danger. The heavy front door creaked open, the air cackling with tension, and Flint stepped inside. Yeah, he did. The entrance hall, blanketed in a harsh fluorescent lighting, echoed with the smooth, jazzy sounds of elevator music, and a cheery receptionist greeted Flint with a welcoming smile as he approached. <laughs> huh? What? Hang on. Uh, this isn't how I remember the story going. Yeah, me neither. It's like Peach's castle got a receptionist and Mario is just having to wait to get his turn at Bowser. <laughs> This will be the time I f wait on. This will be the time I finally defeat Tender. Then I'll no doubt earn the respect and gratitude a hero like myself deserves. <laughs> oh, I love it. Huh? Something seems different here. And eh, no matter. Time to find Tender and settle things once and for all. It is time, dude. I bet this is a save machine with a big old S on it. Yep, game saved. That's what I figured. Okay, look at my boy bounce. Look at him. He's so happy when he does it. Hi, welcome to ha happily. At Wait, hi, welcome to Ever After Inc. Headquarters. How can I help you? I, heroic adventurer Flint Buckler, have arrived to defeat Tender, the fiery scourge of the kingdom. Oh wait, hold on. Allow me through the Dragon's Keep, and I'll spare you a humiliating defeat. Hmm, I don't know any of Tender here. Do you have their extension? <laughs> Oh god, okay. What? I'm talking about the owner of this castle. You know, big, terrifying, fire-breathing dragon. Sir, you seem confused. This is Ever After Inc. We're a company. Certainly no dragons here. I'm not confused. I've... Hmm. Well, maybe I'm a little confused. What's going on? Who are you again? Red Riding Hood, wow, okay, Red Riding Hood's hanging out. Oh, you must be, hmm, this is uncomfortable. Please wait one second while I phone my boss. Hey, uh, sir, I think we got a main character here, oh lord. 
He's going on about finding some dragon or something? Yep, uh-huh. Alright, sounds good. Okay, the manager will see you now. Please head left their offices until you see the door with a moon above it. Can't miss it. Um, okay. Let's do it. Oh, I know. I just want to jump. Oh, look at this! Balls of Fury! That looks like all I got. Nice little HUD. Alright, let's go left. Oh, it's so dope looking. Not enough coins. I'm too broke. Wait, what's it do though? I went too fast. Pay 15 coins to fully restore your team's HP and MP. Oh, I get teams? Look at this. It's Humpty Dumpty. Oh, wait, I gotta read this again. Let's try this again. Our oh, boys are getting trounced this season. Oh, I missed it. He was talking about the game and he fumbled himself and fell. Poor Humpty Dumpty. How about you? Yo, how's it hanging? Uh-oh, uh looks like someone has a serious case of the Mondays. Okay. Well, I do have the Mondays. Look at this place. This isn't the castle. Dude, look at all these creatures. This is so cute. What's up, dog? How about that crazy weather we've been having, huh? <laughs> You don't like it? Wait 10 minutes. Oh, this is too real. How about you, mother hen? Did you hear? Jerry and Kathleen were seen kissing in the courtyard the other day. Can you believe it? Uh, actually, I... Stacy's gonna be devastated. Just devastated. Of course, her and Marissa just broke up last weekend. But personally, I think Marissa still has feelings for Stacy. I mean, do you see the way she slows down passing by her desk? And you're never gonna believe. Sorry to cut you off. I really have to go. Oh, this man looks angry. Is it just me or is the traffic getting worse? I was almost late this morning. Mad man. How about you? Did you know I've gotten really into crocheting lately? I just love crafts. Oh, it's the cousin. Mondays, am I right? You're going on a coffee run anytime soon? I just can't function without my coffee. <laughs> How about you? Are you new here? Welcome. Oh, welcome. Always love to see some fresh blood in the office. Ah, ah, ah. How about you? Looking mad. I used to be a ruthless viking sailing. I used to be a ruthless viking sailing the high seas and pillaging priceless treasures. Now I'm a customer service agent. Anything is possible. Guess so. And we got zombie boy here. Need caffeine. All right, this is a real voice. Ah, you know it's rude to just waltz in into my cubicle without an appointment. I'm trying to work here. This generation, I tell you, they don't make them like they used to. Is this Pinocchio? What a Pinoc. Hey, yo, you want to come out for drinks with me after work? I work hard, but I also play hard. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, I'm busy. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm busy. No biggie, my bud. I'm so lonely. Yep. Can you believe Linda got that promotion? Freaking Linda of our people. How about you, dog? Just a few hours left to go. You can do this. Ahem. I mean, a uh, beep boop processor overload. Dude, who the hell are you hiding out? Shrimpy long stockings. You must be here visiting on a school trip or something. You want free advice? Well, tough luck, buddy. All right, rude asshole. Uh, you must be Flynn. Welcome to Ever After Inc. Headquarters. The manager will see you now. Please proceed through the door on the left. Can I go through this door? Oh, it's locked tight. And we got these dudes up here just holding their guns. Alright, let's go through. This man, though. Welcome! Come on in. Don't be shy. Have a seat. Hey there. Boy, you sure look like a fish out of water. 
I don't know who you are or what's going on, but I'm looking for Tender the Dragon, the owner of this castle? I bet you are, kid. I know this all very I know this is all very confusing. Allow me to introduce myself. Mr. Moon, regional branch manager. I'm the manager in these offices, and I know exactly who you are. In fact, I know everything about you. Flint Buckler, fairy tale hero adventurer. Really nothing we haven't seen before. Pretty run of the mill stuff. I like that laugh. So let's address the elephant in the room. Your arch nemesis, Tinder, no longer owns this castle. We do, and by we, I'm talking about Ever After Ink. What is this Ever After Ink you all keep talking about? Can I write with it? Ha, <laughs> kid, you crack me up. We're talking Ink, as in Incorporated. We're the largest conglomerate in the world. The real world, that is. Oh, look at me getting ahead of myself. So all this around you, you're in a storybook, and your quest to defeat Tender the Dragon is all part of that storybook. Fortunately for you, Ever After Inc. discovered a way to enter storybooks as part of their mission to expand their brand. And we bring the comforts of the modern world to those who live among the confines of fiction, such as yourself. <laughs> Love it. So you have two options here. One, you can turn around and leave. Or two, you can join all the other fairy tale folk and apply for a job. We're always looking for team players to join the Ever After Ink family, and you'd be a great fit. All those other folks in the office used to be just like you. Storybook characters chained to the whims of their creators, doomed to live out the same tired old tales over and over again. Heck, I used to be a storybook character too, until Ever After Ink came and liberated me. A children's book, if you can believe it. Anyway, kid, truth be told, you human characters are pretty popular with corporate. With just a bit of grit and hard work, you might even become a mid-level manager like me someday. You understand what I'm saying here? Um, yeah, I, I get it now. This is all a trick! Tinder set this all up to trick me into leaving. <laughs> She's feeling that, really feeling that threatened by me, huh? Well, the ruse is up. I'm going to defeat Tinder, but first I'll start with you. So it's really gonna be this way, huh, kid? What a disappointment. Smacked him in the face. Cards. Uh, throw him in the dungeon. I don't have time for deluded lunatics. Yes, sir. Man, I'm getting thrown in jail. I just got here. Yeah, let's save the game. I'm in jail. All right, I'm gonna cut the voices off to keep moving through this. We're finally awake. Look at this dragon. Let me guess, she came to my castle yet again to try and defeat me. And now, in a final cruel twist, I'm stuck in here with you. I literally could not imagine a worse fate. Uh, do I know you? Don't give me that, Flynn. I know you're dim, but you can't be that dim. <laughs> Tender? Is that you? You're so small. Yes, of course, it's me, you fool. Even in this pitiful form, I'm still the greatest and most powerful dragon that ever lived. You should be quivering in fear. Tend to the dragon, scourge of the kingdom, but small. So bees it. I didn't even recognize you. You're just so tiny. A minor inconvenience, that's all. One day, I was minding my own business when a whole army of these crooks stormed my castle and started trashing the place. For a dragon like myself, invaders are nothing new. I dispel of them, regularly, with ease. As you know firsthand. But before I could destroy those brutes, they used some technology to disarm me and shrink me down into the pitiful form you see before you. Ever after ink? Ah, so you've been introduced. You see this collar around my neck? It's somehow restricting my fire breathing and keeping me from doing any real damage. But once I get out of this cell and take back my castle, they'll be begging for mercy. Can't you take the collar off? You think I haven't tried? It's no use. It's indestructible. I'll be stuck in this puny form until I find that scheming moon manager and force him to remove it. Wow, that's... I mean, I came here to fight you. I feel kind of bad now. You think I still can't crush you in a fight? I've changed my mind. Now that I'm seeing you like this, I don't really want to rub salt in the wound is all I'm saying. Well, too bad. You're going to regret coming here. Oh no, we got to get through the hardships. 
You know what? I know how to fight. I bet it's like Super Mario. I bet it's like Paper Mario. Fine, fine, fine. Alright. I'll do a buckler throw. Yeah, that's what I figured it was. Nah, I missed it though. Alright, let's try again. Oh. Oh, before it returns to my hand. I can do this? Okay, so before it returns to my hand. Nice. Okay. Oh, I didn't block it! Alright, let's try it again. Man, it's real precise. You don't really get a lot of room for error. I'm not mad at that, though. Alright. I got a donut. So, yeah, okay. Restore HP in battle. Alright, so let's do items. Let's take my donut. I'm ready to go. I won't let you down, friend. Even though we're fighting as enemies, friend. Nah, I want it exactly as it is. Get wrecked, nerd. Get wrecked! I missed. I missed! I can do this. Oh, he got wrecked! And I got to level up a bit. Isn't that nice? Ugh, this is so humiliating. You got lucky, Flint. You did okay, considering the state you're in. I did? <clears throat> I mean, of course I did. What did you expect? Look, we gotta get out of here. Let's put our differences aside for a second and... Differences? Need I remind you that you're the one who keeps coming to my castle to bother me? All I wanted was some peace and quiet. That's not the whole story, and you know it. But my point still stands, we need to get out of here. Well, maybe we're in luck. Those goons left the key just sitting there, right outside the bars. A bunch of amateurs, clearly. Proper key placement is Dungeon 101. Anyways, why don't you throw your buckler to pick it up? I could obviously get it myself, but doing these kinds of dull tasks is beneath me. Oh, is that why you've been sitting in here by yourself for news who knows how long? Don't test me. Just go grab the key by throwing your buckler th through the bars. Now. Fine, I will. God, the music is great in this. Oh. Got it. Congratulations. Took you oh, Dude, it took me like 15 seconds. Okay, you coming? Wow. Just dipping without me. What a butthole. Alright. Good save. Oh, a little bit of platforming? Some cheese on the ground? Give me... Real similar to the Mario coins. I'm not mad at it. I hope Nintendo doesn't get mad at it. They get mad about a lot of stuff. Oh, hell yeah. Destructible environments even in the Paper Mario world? I'm not mad at that. No. Nothing in there. Alright, what's up, dog? Look who's here again. Stand back, Flint. This door is blocked, so I'm gonna bust it down with my trademark fire-breathing technique. Do it, do it, do it, do it. Look at those baby flames. <laughs> at least you still have your horns. Go ahead, laugh all you want. I know I'm a sad sight, but don't think for a second that my fire won't still burn you to a crisp if I aim it your way. Hey, what's all that racket in there? Oh lord, here they come. Gee, I wonder, might have something to do with the key sitting right outside the jail cell. I told you, I told you this would happen, but you insisted on leaving the key there. With what arms am I supposed to carry that key around? Huh, genius? You see any? 
Besides, now's my chance to finally earn that promotion I've been gunning for by sending these fairy tale phonies packing. That's right, time to fight. Well, Flynn, looks like we have to fight these guys together. Now that my life is on the line as well, your bumbling fighting skills simply will not do. I did beat you in a fight just a few moments ago. Yeah, 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 yeah. Do you want a medal or something? Your want and buckler throwing might earn you a spot in the circus, but it's not going to get you very far in battle. Here, drink this coffee. Nice. Okay. So we do got team attacks. I like this. All right, let's do it. So triangle is how I can switch between them. Okay. All right, let's try this then. Hit all grounded enemies. Okay. Nice. Oh, they got real mad. Oh, hell yeah. Give me two MP on this. Oh, hold X. That's on me. Oh, that was also on me. I just let that happen. Man. My boy's gonna die. Oh, get wrecked, nerds! I wonder if health refills between battles. It would make sense for it to. Ah, retreat, retreat! Yeah, we did it. Well, Tender, you fought well. I did. Didn't I? No thanks to your help. Even in this form, I still got it. Right, right, right. Anyways, I've decided we can travel together, but only because you clearly need my protection. Only I'm allowed to defeat you. Understand? I'll be coming with you to ensure these corporate goons don't get the job done before I have a chance to. So you're saying we should team up? Absolutely not. We're just temporarily working together to get out of here so I can banish Ever After Ink from my castle. Then we can get back to fighting and I can finish destroying you. Okay, whatever. Sounds like a plan. Oh, I got Tinder. As I said, I'm not joining the party, but here we are. If anything, you're joining my team. Don't forget it. Anyways, as you know, I can breathe fire. Only a little bit, though. This Ever After Ink collar prevents me from wreaking havoc like I used to, but I can still ignite some flammable objects. For example, on the torches and ragged banners like these. Press square to activate my flame and use left and right to aim. Try it out now. Okay. Whee! Oh, I actually have to aim. Okay, cool. Nice. Nice. They barricaded the store shut again. We need to find another way out. If I remember correctly, there's a secret passageway somewhere in this room. Let's find it. Okay. We will. I know exactly where it's at. Let's light all the torches. Make this a real mood. That's how we get through here. Look at this hole, though. Nice. We made it. We saved the game. How should I know? Do you really expect a busy dragon like myself to know everything that goes on in her dungeon? Oh, you're a girl. That's not, that shouldn't be surprising. It just hasn't been stated till now. That is true. I break into your place a lot, according to the story. Probably a switch around here or something. It's basic stuff. Okay. I can find a switch. I also find this donut. I found it. Oh, we're gonna have to go fight my boy. Nah, I'm good. I know how first strikes work. Just like most games, hit first. That way you get first move. Like this. Oh, he got me first though.
Okay. Okay, so... Okay, strategic planning. I like this. Ow. Got it. Let's do this. This energy. Tactics. Interesting. Items. And I don't need you. Alright, so let's... Do I still have, nah, don't have synergy yet. Okay, so we can do this though. Ow! Nice! Alright, so I gotta do this though. I don't even have that? You know what though? Now I can burn you. Get wrecked, nerd. Oh, he got this blocked down. Oh, and he got wrecked. So health does not keep between battles, so I gotta I gotta eat. Oh no! That's on me! That was also on me. I have to do it then. There it is. Now I can breathe fire on you. That's what you get for poking me. Man, I'm gonna need some health here soon. We did it! Nice, I'll take some Joe. Alright, there's one. There's our door. And a chest. Nifty, but I never understood why you installed all these obtuse puzzles around your castle. Yes, it's a bit tacky, I must admit, but in my youth it was a stylish thing to do. Wait, how old are you? <laughs> 1,342 years. Oh. Neat. Well. Burn you up. Burn you up. Put my coin. And Buckler Barrage. Oh, hell yeah. Hey, you found a trinket. Do you need me to explain how trinkets work? Nope. All right, I'm gonna equip it too. I wonder if I have to equip it. Flint. There it is. All right, let's keep moving forward. Oh, what's up, Doc? Oh! That's how we do. Man, we got like flying boys. Yeah, and no more shields for you, bitch. Man. Damn, dude. Oh, no. Oh, my boys. You can't handle this. Just like that, that's how we take you down. Oh, I can't do anything to you. Okay.
Nice. Damn it. Can I hit you? I can. There it is. Nice. Okay, that's really fun. You get you can be a little tactile about it. I'm not mad at that. And you get paid. Can I go in the water? No. There's one. Well, those sorts of, but since we can't reach the one over there, you can try throwing your buckler to carry me my flame across the gap. I your wings don't work, and it sucks. All right, but you guys stop being a big baby about this. I like that. Nice, nice, nice. We're moving forward. Journey, journey, journey. Super cool. A muffin. You know what? What items do I have right now? No, I don't need eight yet. Oh, I got you! Nah, I don't want to run away. And do this. Mm hmm. Yeah, that's how we do it. I'm finally getting the rhythm down with it. I'm almost there to a level up. Excited for this. All right, give me my money. Oh, I can even just like journey straight forward from here. Okay. Guess I'll have to get a key. Oh, nice. If ever acting as capable, they seem the key should be still there. Let's go, Flint. You got it, buddy. All right. I don't think so. Oh, he still got me, you dirty butthole. Direct nerd. Damn it. His is hard. Oh, that one didn't work. But it's okay. I'm going to breathe him into out of existence. Get flamed. Wasn't enough. Jesus. Well, steep learning curve. I do want to see if I can go through here. Oh, it's a secret chest. Oh, a chance to dodge. Okay, so let's do this. Let's, one, use my battle item. There we go. Yep. Okay, so I can only have that right now? Okay. Well, then I can get outfits, too. Alright, let's go to the treasure room. I've been saving Adam. Oh, but I just used my battle items. 
Oh no, I got a donut though! We're back up and running. How expensive are you? Yeah, 10 coins is worth it. Whoops. Yeah, that's what I figured. Okay. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Let's go up here. Uh, you don't get first strike, not on me. There it is. Oh, I messed up. It's okay, I got that though. I did not get that. Yeah. We're just a couple fights away from leveling up. All right. Let's grab all these coins. Got to get paid. Look at these boys, though. All right, team, grab as much as you can carry. This is one of the only treasure stores that Ever Inc. hasn't found yet. I right, boss. Hey, get your hands off my gold. Your gold? This statue used to belong to a dragon named Tinder. You confused or something? We got just as much a right to this here gold as anyone else. I am Tinder, you fool. <laughs> right, pal. Tinder's supposed to be big and intimidating. And you're... Well, look at you. Yeah, you're not fooling anyone, bud. How about I bring you live as a demonstration? Tinder, relax. Let's just talk it out. Nobody messes with my gold. Least of all, some shrimpy little rodents. Again, pal, not your gold. Tender or not, it belongs to Ever After Inc. Now and well. They're certainly not going to miss it if we skim off this one little stash. Maybe we'll even give you a small cut if you quit your whining. That's it. I'm giving you three seconds to scram before I make you wish you'd never been born. Three. Hi, you're messing with the wrong mice, pal. Two. Uh, boss, this character is looking real familiar. Are we sure Tender isn't... One. We're waiting. Time's up. Prepare to face my wrath. All right, so we got the one final boss fight. This might be the prologue end. Oh shit, they're stacking on each other. Okay. Let's see here. I don't need synergy right now. Let's, oh, I gotta hit him. All right, so should I hit the base? Let's do it. All right, disarmed him. Actually. Probably gonna try to poke me. No. Oh, he's. Yeah, he didn't do well, though. Oh, it's a double hit. Jeez, that second hit was a fat. It was a big one. Okay, let's, um. Hit all grounded. Oh, wait, it's gonna bounce off. Disarmed him. Let's do this, now that he's disarmed. Didn't deflect much. Man. Tender might go down. Oh, shit. They redid their whole attack. No! Oh, I wasted it. All right. Let's get our donut in play here. I need some health. And that sucked. Okay. Let's use our synergy. All right, let's, um, let's try this headbutt. Oh, he got stunned, dude. Okay.
There's one down. Let's fire breath him. He's still alive, even. Alright, whatever. We're just gonna take all of you down. Ow. Got it. Oh, he's down. Okay. Last one, then. This should kill you, too. It did not. That did, though. And that is a level up! I feel pretty good. The prologue's been fun. It's... It's Paper Mario! A bonus, even! Team's TP and equip more trinkets. That's exactly what we're doing up front. Yep, yep. Nice. All right, we got past it. Okay, we give up. You're lucky you still have your whiskers. But alas, the mighty and powerful Tinder is feeling merciful today. So you really are a Tinder, huh? How the mighty have fallen. Now look at you. You're a shrimp. Mad about it, even. Amina, you're just much smaller than we expected, that's all. Once I get off this collar device that was forced around my neck, I'll be back to normal imposing size. And I certainly won't be needing to fight alongside my sidekick here. Sidekick? Really? Ah, so you've been collared. Ever After Ink really did a number on you. Don't feel bad. They've done much worse to much stronger storybook folk. Be grateful they only neutralized you. So who are you mice anyway? And why are you down here? We're the three blind mice. More specific, like, my name's Nickel. <laughs> I'm Penny, and I'm Scratch. Nice to be acquainted. The three blind mice, seemingly not blind. <laughs> Heard of us? We're loyal employees of Ever After Ink now. Ask for while we're down here? Well, we're not so loyal that we won't skim some gold off the top when the opportunity arises. You're from a book of nursery rhymes? Why would you leave a cushy place like that to go work for a horrible company like Ever After Ink? First off, notice how his three blind mice aren't blind anymore? Yep, that's right. Dental and vision insurance. Them optometrists fix us right up. <laughs> and besides the book we come from, that land of nursery rhymes and other fables, it's been totally destroyed, of course. Wow. Uh-huh. That's kind of what this company does. They come into a book, sap the world of all its resources, employ the characters that they deem able enough to work, and leave the rest a wreck. Yep, storybooks are an untapped market. Valuable resources, cheap labor, and most importantly, profit to be made. It was only a matter of time before someone did something about it. That's insane! Why do these scum- who do these scumbags think they are? Look at those little puffy cheeks. I'll tell you who they think they are. They're the largest conglomerate in all the universe. They're not from storybooks like us, they're from the real world, and they can do whatever they want. Maybe so, but once we get out of this dungeon, we're taking them down. Are you out of your minds? This isn't some fairy tale folk tale no more. It's over. You're done. And believe me, they have little tolerance for rebellious main characters such as yourself. That collar they forced on you? That's just the beginning. You can't win here, fellas. Sorry. So what do you suggest we do? You really want to make a difference here? Get a job. Work your way up. You could do far more damage to Ever After Ink from behind a desk than from a jail cell. Ha! I tender the most powerful dragon who has ever lived as a desk jockey? No, thank you. Suit yourself, pal. Anywho, it was nice meeting you and all, but it's time for us to skedaddle. See ya! Nice knowing ya! Bye! Seriously, guys, consider who the bo what the boss is saying. If we hadn't complied, we would have disappeared with the rest of our story. It's a bummer. Well, Tender, what do you think? What do you... What do I think? It's ludicrous! You can't seriously be considering getting a job! Uh, let's just get out of here. After that, you can do whatever you want. My spare key is in that chest. We can use it to escape the dungeon. Okay. Got a key. And an ink bottle. Nice. I think that's going to be the end of the prologue. Let's 
spend some money. Oh, I didn't even need it. Whatever. Well, that I think is a great place to stop. I want to leave some wiggle room for you if you want to play the prologue. That was through the first boss fight. I'm pretty excited for this. This is really fun. It's cute. It has a great style. It's very Paper Mario reminiscent. The writing is silly and it's charming. It's definitely something I think uh, we should all keep a lookout for. So uh, I hope you enjoy the demo and I will catch you in the next one.